Welcome back to Virtualize Everything. Today we're going to be making a rather short video, but to look at something that's fairly important here on TrueNAS, and that's going to be how to set a static IP address here on TrueNAS. Now, if you're using your TrueNAS both as a Docker server or a quote-unquote apps server, as TrueNAS calls it, or a virtualization server, or even a target for a lot of shares. It's relatively important that you make sure you have a singular IP address on your network to communicate with TrueNAS on. That way you don't have it floating all over the place as your DHCP server renews IP addresses and changes its location. This could be rather seldom, but if you did a full power reboot of your system or something, it is a potential to happen. Let's take a look at how to create a static IP address here on TrueNAS. The first thing you're going to want to do here at the TrueNAS dashboard is to select Select networking and here at networking we're going to select our Ethernet in our case ours is called ENS 18 and we're going to move over to our pencil our pencil is going to bring up an editing window just like here and we're going to deselect DHCP with DHCP deselected we're going to click on the aliases line add and we're going to enter our IP address. Mine's going to be 192.168.3. And I'm going to reuse the 48 that my server's already identified as because I don't really want it to change as everything's already set up. Now with this IP address set up, we're also going to need to add the CIDR notation of slash 24 for a standard network. Now, there is a possibility this could be different in your network depending on how your sub netting works. But for most standard networks in most houses, slash 24 is going to be the desired selection. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit save. And it's going to ask me if we have the correct default gateway, which it does, or to give it the new default gateway. I can go ahead and hit skip because the default gateway is correct. And there you have it. I have a static IP address set up here on TrueNAS scale and ready to be used for many other projects. If you liked this video, found it informational, and were able to get a static IP address set up on TrueNAS scale successfully, consider liking, sharing, and subscribing. Also look at some of the other great TrueNAS content that we've released in the recent few weeks. As always, have a good night.